start off by priming my eyelid with Catrice Liquid Camouflage Concealer. Going to the palette that I built with ColourPop, I am using this shade called 143 to build up the crease. I'm placing this color above the crease and then just wiggle my brush back and forth and dipping back into the purple some more and just building up that intensity. I'm also going to put this shade on my outer corner and then just slowly building this shade up and then I'm going to switch to a smaller blending brush and then I'm going to continue to repeat the step just to make sure it's nice and intense. Now we're going to cut the crease. I'm going back with the same concealer, the Catrice Liquid Camouflage and just dot a little bit on my eyelid. Make sure you look up so you know where to cut it. And I'm going to start by cutting it using a flat top brush. I'm going into my NYX glitter glue and I'm gonna squeeze some in my finger and just lightly pat it all over where I cut the crease. I'm going into this shade called Blitz Emesis from Mother Pat and I'm going to pack it all over where I cut the lid. And I want to go into some concealer just to clean up this crease shade. I kind of feel like I blended a little slightly too high. And I want to put some other colors on there too. So yeah, I'm just using some concealer to clean that up. I'm going into this deep purple shade and I'm just lining where I put my glitter and the 143 shades. Just I want a line between that. I probably could have used a smaller detailing lining brush to do this. Um, it's my first time doing this look. Next time, I'll make a note. I probably should use a thinner brush. Now I'm going to the first brush with the 143 shade and just further blend things out. Dipping back into that deep purple shade, I'm just gonna deepen my outer corner. pop some hot pink this is from ColourPop called Sam Bar I just want to blend a little pink onto the edges to create that gradient effect back with the first blending brush I'm just trying to blend things out I know this look is not as perfect as I would like it to be Purple is kind of hard to work with, but anyways, I'm going back with some NYX glitter glue and then I want to use a tiny detailing brush. I'm pressing the glitter glue on my inner corner, so then we can go into that lime green neon shade called Keep Scrolling from ColourPop. And I'm dipping my brush into that and then I'm just going to pack it on my inner corner. And then to take things to the next level, I'm going to VR Fire Opal and I'm going to pop that shade on my inner corner. Taking a packing brush, I'm dipping into Astro Ghost Orchid and then I want to further intensify and bring that dimension to the center of my eyelid. into some more concealer and I want to conceal my under eye and clean things up a little bit. I'm going 
going back in with that deep purple shade and I'm just gonna smoke out my lower lash line. I'm taking it almost all the way to the front, but I'm still leaving a little negative space in the front of my eyes. And then I'm also smoking out my outer corners just to connect. Back to 143, this purple shade, I'm going to smoke it out and blend it into my lower lash line. I'm gonna curl my lashes and do my mascara and then I'm gonna go off to pop on some false lashes. I'll be back. Back to that neon green shade, I am going to put that on my lower inner corner. Going into Dream Street palette, I want to highlight and clean up my brow bone. I'm going into this shade called Mooney. And for one side of my face, I decided to highlight some more. I'm going into this highlight from 1028. Just gonna pop that on the top of my cheekbones, some of my forehead, just because I feel like it. This is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoy this look. I really like how it turned out. I mean, yeah, there's some places I could have done better, but yeah, I mean, this is my first time. Next time, if I do this look again, I'll make sure to take my own advice. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really love doing my makeup with you guys. Comment down below and let me know what you guys think about this look. Like this video if you like it. Follow me on Instagram. I love you guys. I'll talk to you later. Mwah.